we go. First ball off the, the third match in this Continental Cup. Yeah. And it's going to be a wicket straight away. Well, it's going to be a royal duck. Uh, unfortunate for the batter. Short again, goes down the ground. It's high, and it's going to be one bounce to the boundary. Full toss, and this is hit hard down the ground. And it gets hit straight down four runs. Oh, dear. Well, short Maria Gunda. Bapas Agi Bundi, because that was not a good shot at all. Played up in the air and taken. It's going to be another wicket. And uh, Lucy Barnett gets her second. Wasn't uh, wasn't quite there. Didn't get to the pitch of this. Look at that. There's no weight being distributed into the shot. And a very really good bit of fielding as well. And that is the end of the Ashani Muthagal. She'll go for three. Can we let Jennifer is out there? Gets joined by New Bedham. Now this is going to take some stopping. And it's unfortunate for the fielder. I thought we were going to see some more magical foot fielding. And well, four and out. It's another wicket for Lucy Barnett. She takes her third, three for nine now. And once again, it just uh, the wrong shot to play. Oh, this is up in the air. It could be out, it should be out, and it will be out. So it's another wicket. And unfortunately, well, the youngster, the Gorilla Jennifer will not get into the scorebook. It's going to be a three ball duck for her as well. That's disappointment for the young lady. That's a nice looking shot. Chase is on, on the round, the Iba Iba, but you ain't going to catch that grizzly. You're not going to catch it. You either dive and get into some grizzly action and try and stop it. If you can't, it's gone. Oh, and that's really well bowled. And. Uh, Smiles on the face of uh, the captain, Aliana Thorpe. It gets her second wicket, and she just pushes this one right up there. And maybe that's uh, that's what Daniela Murphy said. Said, skip, pitch it up further, and she does. Pitches it up, and like I said, you miss, I hit. And it could be gone. It will be gone. And guess who? Yes, it is. Joanna Hicks comes into the attack and gets a wicket with her very first ball. Goes to get one on the stump, says the edge, and gone. And that's what they're there for. That is what they're there for. They're not there just to intimidate. They're there to take the catches as well. And Lucy Barnett takes a catch. And unfortunately, uh, Madalena Marin will go for a duck. It's going to be a, a four-ball duck. This could be out. It will be out. The batter is going to be a wide, but the batter standing outside the crease. Good work there from Rebecca Webster. And we're going to see a stumping. And that will be the end of it. It tries to give herself a little bit of room, does uh, Christina Sander, but instead she sees the ball go onto the stump. So Joanna Hicks, there's another three for for Joanna. And uh, Joanna took two for nine in the first match. Well, she's taken five wickets in the day. That's not bad at all. And uh, that will be the end of the innings. <laughs>
this one will help. It's short, hit hard, Fielder out there, but can't do anything about it. It's a spicy bounce. Oh, well, that's not where you want to be going after a long day. Up the hill you go. Uh, that's going to work the, uh, the old legs up the top of the mountain to get that one. And still, you've got to find it, but too short, drops it short and pays the price, pays the penalty. And it's good contact made. And will get through the fielder, and it's going to be four runs. Goes for the big hit, and we'll just... Oh, great effort. That would have been a sensational catch. Really would have. Comes in from the boundary. And that's uh, Karila Jennifer again. Comes in. Got the shades on as well. Looking the part, looking the business. Comes in. Doesn't shy away from it. That's what I like from the youngster. And that's going to be four runs. Once it goes down there, the vortex sucks it in. Uh, doing this in style. And that is well hit. That could be the match. It will be the match. It's too hot and spicy for the fielder out there. That's four runs. And that is it, folks. It's an incredible victory. They do it with just 10 balls. 10 balls are required for victory here. And, well, what a statement that is from the women from the Isle of Man. They are victorious, and they only need 10 balls to chase the 42 required for victory. It's sensational.